Since I met you, you have been my best friend, my mentor, my playmate, but most importantly, you are the love of my life and you make me happier than I could have ever imagined. You have made me a better person, a person my grandfather would be proud of. I am truly blessed to be part of your life, which as of today becomes our life together forever. You came into my life, a point that I was definitely not looking for love. Little did I know that my life would change so dramatically. Two very different people, one incredible love story. I promise to spend <laughs> the rest of my life making you laugh and smile. You are my handsome prince, my pecan, my bung nut, my mung bean, but most importantly of all, you're my best friend and I love you. As I look at Krista today, I can't help but feel proud to see the woman that she's become. She, ca <laughs> she captured my heart um, on the day that she was born. She's my little girl, my princess, and my ray of sunlight. And no matter what her age, she will always be that to me. Tim has shown me that he is a man. He has shown me that he has my daughter's best interest in hand accepting and helping her through her good days and her bad days. Lucky for him, the good outnumber the bad. Believe it or not, Tim is a traditionalist. And not sure why he waited until I left the country, but he rang me and asked for my daughter's hand in marriage. And for the help to set up the family surprise so that we could bear witness to this proposal along with the Cheney clan. Krista tells me one day she's a little suspicious that Jeannie's going to propose and she wanted all the details. Well, I had none because he didn't get my approval. The night before the big question, Jeannie pulls me aside and shows me a photo of a ring. Well, I'm in a pickle. I've told her I know nothing and now I know everything. I know the exact moment it's happening. So what do I do? I lie to her face again. <laughs> because that's what friends do. 14 months later, here we are. He made it. And I am so honoured to be a part of your special day and have my daughter as a part of your special day. It was her dream to walk for you and she did today. Don't cry. <laughs> and I hope you both realise how perfect you are for each other because you would not have come this far if you weren't. Ian decided he was going to ask this lovely lady in front of us to marry him. So they went for a romantic walk along the river just opposite here, us here at the Brisbane Botanical Gardens, City Gardens. Ian organised his mum, sister, grandmother and Krista's family to be there at the end of the pathway where he planned to ask her to marry him. He was so nervous he tried to make a bit of small talk. Ian said to Krista, do you think we'll see a fish? And Krista replied, don't be stupid, it's the Brisbane River. And what happened? A very large fish popped its head out of the water. He knew that this was the perfect moment to ask. The fish gods had sent him a sign. So on bended knee, he asked and she said yes. Seriously, I'm so proud to be the best man here today. You're both amazing, caring people, and I know your life together will be an inspiration to the rest of us, and are very lucky to have found each other. This day has been incredible. I 
have got to marry the most incredible man. <laughs> and I look forward to the rest of our days together. It is going to be trying, but I love you. Love you too.